Hello, TypeTrace here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to convert text into shapes and how you can customize it in Illustrator. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So first, let's try to write some text. Select the type tool right here. You can also use the keyboard shortcut T. Let's just press on the artboard here and let's type in type. And let's scale this up a bit so we can see it. As you can see, this is just a normal text and we can edit it if we go in the type tool and we can write something else if we want to. But let's say we want to change the shape of the type. You would think that you could select the points in the type if you select the direct selection tool and just press on the points right here but you can't and it's not the same if you for example have a circle and you want to change the points and when we work with text and we want to edit the anchor points we actually need to expand the text the only thing you want to make sure when expanding is you can't go back and write a new text in the same text field i will show you in just a bit but let's try to expand this text so we can change the anchor points do that by first select your text and go up in the objects panel right here and press on the expand now you get this menu right here and you can see that the object and fill is checked that's just fine let's just go down here and press ok and just like that the text is now expanded and as you can see, if we try to select the type tool again and try to click on the text, we now can't edit the text because it's expanded and it has created the text into shapes instead. It's a great idea to make a copy of your text before you expand it so you always can go back and change it later if it's necessary. Now we can actually customize and edit the text we just expanded. You can do that by selecting the direct selection tool again Use the keyboard shortcut A and just select an anchor point you want to change. Let's select this one and you can now drag it up if you want to extend it. Let's try another one. We can take this and drag it a bit down. And as you can see, you can now start to customize the text as you would like. And let's take this E for an example and we want to make this line straight right here. You can now select the anchor point and hold shift while dragging and it's now a straight line as you can see. It is also possible to make the text curvy. If you click on a letter you can drag on this and it will make curves on the letter. It is also possible to add shapes into the text. So if you for example use the pencil you can draw something and create it as a part of the text. I'll just play a quick time lapse of how you can customize the text. You can also change the position of the letters. If you select the direct selection tool again, you can select just one letter and place it down or in any other position. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. And if you have anything you want to learn in the Adobe programs, comment them down below and we will try to create a video for just that. That was all for now. See you in the next one.